Hello, my beautiful people. Yes, Megan doesn't grasp what being a princess is or how royal titles work. And we're going to find out why right now, because now she wants to be called Princess of Sussex. Megan, the Princess of Sussex. I kid you not. This is for people to see the difference between Princess Diana and Rachel Meghan Markle. Because many people keep saying that Meghan is just like Princess Diana. Princess Diana understood that the royal prince came before her. Just like when, to give an example to my American friends or the people who watch me in Canada, it's like the president comes before the vice president. The, I don't see a position where Kamala Harris is going to step in front of Joe Biden if he's present. She will always defer to the pre president because that's what happens. That's what positions give you. Positions give you a rank. Okay. So look, you just saw Princess Diana waiting, marking and making sure that the Prince of Wales got ahead of her because she understood that his position outranked hers okay Meghan Markle doesn't understand that because Meghan Markle has convinced Harry that oh we got to break the mold this is how she this is how she pitched it to him oh we're gonna break the mold see what they did to your mom is that correct that's not good for my mental health because we got to do things differently Harry so I'm gonna go first always always gonna go first to show them that way that idiot thinks that oh he's breaking a mold not that he's not that important but that he's breaking a mold because he knows that he always has the option to go back being the main cheese okay so because Megan has brainwashed him into thinking that that is cool to do because they're breaking the mold by him letting him go first to show the royals what she's actually done is emasculated remove whatever little balls he had left so now she's not happy with the Duchess of Sussex moniker. Now she wants to be called the Princess of Sussex. This is why we've seen Tyler Perry. When Tyler Perry said, oh, you know, what's so nice to wish the princess a happy birthday. He was talking about Meghan. This is why we've seen others refer to her as princess. You know that when Kelly Rowland said that, oh my God, Meghan Markle was, she didn't need the royal family because she was born royal. Ay Dios mío, I mean, where was that? I didn't know Mr. Markle and, and Doria Raglan were royals or had any royal lineage. But this is the lengths that things have gone. And the reason why Meghan now wants to be called the Princess of Sussex is because she, either she's a complete imbecile, which proves my point that she never studied international studies at Northwestern University because she would know better. Or things have gone to her head either or by the way guys don't forget to like share and subscribe help this girl out and um and yes and follow me on facebook so can you imagine that megan doesn't get that sussex the duke of sussex is a title given to her husband she does not hold any titles on her own she's rachel megan markle on her own but not only because she considers that why should her kids be prince and princess and not the mother while the father is also a prince. So she's now asking and she's going to start putting out that she's Meghan, the princess of Sussex, just like Catherine is the princess of Wales. She doesn't understand how things work, which is actually quite laughable. Do you think that Meghan understands this? And actually, I wonder if the palace is going to put their foot down and say, stop it, stop it. Because we've seen Harry interfere in Canadian politics by talking to the First Nations, Nations chief and the palace has remained quiet. We have seen how Charles has allowed Princess Catherine to be trashed and trounced 
while Camilla, in order to, because if you notice, it's Catherine's image that's been trounced and oh, Camilla's the savior of the royal family. Is this done on purpose? Was this, is this, and I, I, I know you guys, you know, I don't like Charles. I, you know that. I don't, I don't hurry to know. But are they doing that on purpose? Because they want to keep Camilla on top. Oh, Camilla's complaining that she had to do 13 engagements. Keep in mind that Camilla's like Harry. It's not that she's involved every day. There's a team of people who arrange everything. All she has to do is get in the car, be driven by chauffeur and, um, and royal protection officers, tour the facilities for about an hour, and get the hell out of there. So she had to do that 13 times. And it's exhausting. It's exhausting. <laughs> we never saw the queen complain up to the age of 92. This lady still with cancer. We saw her bruised hand. So we have a bunch of lazy people. And what well, Catherine, who's seriously recovering from, she's recovering from a serious illness, is being allowed to trounce. I haven't heard a peep from King Charles saying, please respect Catherine. Like, you, do you remember when uh, the queen did that with, uh, with uh, Diana? When the queen said that the press were invading Diana's privacy and she actually called all the press to Buckingham Palace and said, listen, leave this, leave this lady alone because Princess Diana was pregnant, I believe. Leave Princess Diana alone. She did that. The queen did that. Yet Charles can't do that for his darling daughter-in-law. Complete lack of balls in my, in my very humble opinion. So I have a full, I, I don't expect Charles to put his foot down and actually issue a statement saying Meghan can't call herself Princess of Sussex because there's no such title. Because people like Meghan who are incredibly abusive, incredibly abusive, never de-escalate. They always escalate said behavior until they're really put in their place and they're stopped. Do you think that when she goes ahead and starts doing this, that she, that Buckingham Charles will actually put his foot down? Or do you think he'll say, oh, well, just let her call herself whatever she wants without thinking of the repercussions that it will have in the monarchy? How it, how it would belittle, how it denigrates and lowers the value of royal titles by Meghan keep, keeping, keep using these titles and even making titles up. I mean, at what point will the royal family say enough is enough? At what time would Charles start acting as a monarch and protect Princess Catherine from all the online bullying that's happened? Meghan Markle preaching kindness. Oh, let's all be kind. Princess Catherine is a female who is under, unlike Meghan Markle, who makes up her made up ailments. She's actually ill, seriously ill, recovering, thankfully. And yet she hasn't said a kind word word about his sister-in-law she hasn't said one kind word about his sister-in-law they haven't wished her well oh you know they were mean to me online because i was coat flicking like crazy and showing that moon bump so what do you think the ramifications are do you think there will be any consequences when Meghan markle starts calling herself princess of sussex megan the princess of sussex because she will say that she is a princess. We've seen people call her princess. As I said, Kelly Rowland saying, you know, she's, a, she's a royal blood when she doesn't need the royal family because she's royal herself. Tyler Perry on record. I mean, other of her friends, oh, the princess, she's a princess. She made sure she put on the kids on, on Archie's birth certificate, her profession, not Rachel Meghan Markle actress. No, 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 no. Or a failed actress, no. Her title was Princess of the United Kingdom. An American woman who couldn't even stand only did 72 engagements in 18 months. I mean, this is all insane, but this is how bad things are. Please leave me your comments and let me know what you think, beautiful people. And as usually, thanks for always coming here to watch.